Who you want to be happy. We all want to be happy. But what does happiness look like for you? What does it mean to you to be happy? Does it mean a bigger car, a newer model? Well, that car is going to be out of date next week. And though your car, the one that you've been craving, will get older. And you'll soon get used to all the things that it has inside it. All those gizmos. Will you be happy when you have the latest TV set? Again, that will also date because we're always bombarded with something new. Will it be when you're in a happy relationship? What does that mean? Are you looking for someone to make you happy? And what are you expecting of them? What does that mean? I want you to make me happy. Is that possible? I don't believe it is. I believe that we have to decide on our own happiness what it means. And I would argue that it's more than happiness, it's contentment. Being content with what we have. And only you can measure that. Being content with a relationship and the important things that that relationship brings for you. We can't have everything in our relationship. No one person can meet all of our needs. So it's more important that we find somebody who has the same core values as us. If they match, or almost match, we're more likely to have a happy, contented relationship. So think about what it is that makes you content, because if you're always chasing that next piece of technology, that next dream, that big holiday, that new piece of clothing, you're never going to find contentment and you'll always be unhappy. So think about those things that you need to help you feel content and happy.